Hello everybody, my name is Dream Creator. Welcome back to my channel. So, to start, there has been a lot of changing. Obviously, I'm in a new setting. Um, back in March, I moved. And um, even before then, back in December, videos were starting to slow down. So I apologize for that. But I did move. So that was a big reason for not being active. Um, but anyways, so... There is going to be a few kind of updates in this video, but I'm going to try to make it fun and it's going to be good because I've tried making this video over the course of three weeks now, several different times because I haven't found the right words to use yet and every time I feel like I mess up. So this is going to be the final product. No more tiptoeing around. I'm just going to release the video. Hope you guys like it. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of announcing, a little bit of um, unboxing if you will showing off and um, we're just gonna get right, right into it so basically like I had mentioned um, I moved back in March to from my parents to now my aunt's house I will give you guys a room tour once everything is set up and complete as you can see there's a lot of wires behind me um, this is a little bit of an older house so I only have one outlet in my room so everything in my room is currently running off of one outlet my computer, however, is in outside of this room. The door is right there. Um, basically, um, I haven't been posting gaming videos because my computer hasn't been up and running. Um, I've been gaming on my PlayStation, which is directly in front of me on a big TV. Um, so I am going to hopefully live stream. I'm not ready yet to start uploading from my computer. Haven't gotten that set up yet. The Amazon package, um, one of the Amazon packages that I had recently ordered is coming in the mail today that will help me connect the last bit of the Ethernet cables up and get it up and running with the internet. But anyways, so that was basically that portion of why I've been gone. Now, what I'm going to do to come back is the second part of the three-staged announcement thing that I'm doing here today. So basically, I am going to try and post vlog videos um whether that be hiking or different type of video that i am now introducing to my channel paranormal investigations um are trending on youtube with some big creators um call me chris das games um sam and colby obviously have been doing it a while selena spooky boo so those are some big youtubers that i've been watching some gathering some intel on um there is some even stories of uh, not stories, but I know I have a great aunt who um, I think I would classify her as a medium. She's had visions and stuff like that. And um, so I have kind of reached out. I'm going into a new area um, that I've never explored before. I'm going to try to do some investigations. We've already done one. Um, my fiance now, which is another big update. Um, I proposed to him on Philly Pride on June 4th of this year, so that is a really big update. Um, I am now engaged, and uh, I think he's doing his own little proposal thing since he didn't get to propose to me, so, because he, uh, after I proposed, um, kids, cover your ears. But uh, after I proposed, he was like, you a-hole. And I was like, what? He was like, I wanted to propose first. And I was like, well. Um, so once I get my bearings in order and get everything up and running, I will post some really cute uh, videos of that. It was really exciting uh, with the help of my family. Um, only a few people knew uh, that went with us. And... It was really something special and I'm really glad that I did it but uh, anyways enough of me gushing I'm like smiling so much now thinking about it that I'm engaged uh, it's so weird now whenever I go to like text people or tell people about um, Kyler my uh, fiance I, I sometimes within the past like two weeks I finally think I've got a justice saying fiance but at first I was like boyfriend boyfriend I was like oh wait no fiance and it's so weird because I'm like Every time I think of it, I'm like, smiling, like, oh my god. So, um, that was another thing that I had to drop at you guys. I wanted to do it in a separate video, but I've done so many remakes of this video. I just want to... Oh, something in my eye. Oh. 
I just want to get this video out to you guys and apologize for being gone so long. Um, it still is, like, my YouTube is not dying. I refuse to let it die. Um, I will upload stuff. Um, it may be a while before I get into a heavy routine, but, um, I'm gonna try to upload stuff constantly. But, that leaves us to, I'm gonna try to make this video a little bit shorter, but a little bit fun, because, um, today we are going to do an unboxing of something along the lines of paranormal so um, those of you um, watching that are familiar with paranormal investigations know the equipment used um, there's EMF detectors which is electromagnetic um, frequency detector because um, entities uh, ghosts emit um, electric field so if you're near one or an entity um, it can go off from one to five. There's a little scale nut. Um, I am getting one of those soon, but it is not the thing that I am boxing today. Um, there is also what is called a REM pod, and that is uh, measures a bunch of different things. I don't exactly know the technical terms of it, but I will be getting one of those not soon, but eventually in the future, maybe a year or two down the road. Um, that is a little bit more expensive than the other um, items. Um, there's like cat bowl toys that are obviously super, super easy to get. Um, I will order those soon. Uh, hopefully get some of those. So my channel will be still gaming, but for the moment we're going to switch over, kind of switch gears and go into kind of more paranormal investigation, um, trying to prove the existence of these things. And, um, I have never... Uh, experience anything paranormal for myself um, neither has anybody in my family or anybody to know other than my great aunt um, so hopefully um, we will be able to experience some things get some readings uh, so experience something I'm really excited there is a few haunted places around um, the area that I live in that we would be able to visit um, so without further ado the last item or the at least the fourth I think fourth item that I can think of that is usually used in paranormal investigations um, besides obviously flashlights and um, thermometers this actually counts as a temperature gauge um, is a spirit box so as I unwrap this I already peeled it off so that satisfactory moments over I did it yesterday I was really excited um, basically what a spirit box is is a little device that goes through does like hundreds of radio frequencies um, and you basically put it, um, headphones on and you listen to these radio frequencies and usually you have another person with you and they'll be asking questions um, while you have the he headset on and when it's when you have the headset on I hope it comes with one or something if not I'll just use something but basically when you have it on you can't hear what they're saying what they're asking or anything so basically they're asking questions you can't hear them asking questions but you're like in your head listening to the radio at frequencies and you'll hear a voice pop out several voices and you s say what you hear like if you hear like dog or something like that and so Anyways, um, looks like it might come with instructions, so I might be able to tell you guys more specifically. Okay. Oh, okay, so this one's a little bit, I guess, newer. Um, this isn't off of Ghost Shop, which is probably what I should have got it off of. It's off of Amazon, kind of like a third-party one, so hopefully it works fine, but it looks like... So this one is a PSB7T Spirit Box, an ITC research device with temperature measurement displays also. So basically, um, it says here there's multifunction displays, and it shows temperature changes, um... There's no tone alert now for temperature changes. Oh, I um apparently before um when there was temperature changes and you had that on, 
it, the temperature change, you could hear it in the earbuds, and now there's no longer one, so that's interesting. Okay. So that was basically a little um, update page. So I got this off of Ghost Hunters Equipment by Ghost Augustine. If you guys want to get one, it's a little bit backwards right now. But um, I would suggest probably either this, hopefully it works, or getting one off of um, ghostshop.com, I believe it is. It's like whole ghost thing. So it says it's a multifunctioning frequency sweep radio. The user, it's a user adjustable high speed sweep rate down to 100 um, ms. I'm being stupid. Um, but it's integrated temperature measurement display. There's a built-in flashlight and a red black light LED display, which I did not know. Um, it's not like a white display, it's red. So open it up here. Oh, it's a little bit smaller than I expected. Cool, cool, the instruction manual. So I will, I'm gonna shut it back up and let you guys see this beauty. Tilt it for ya. Look at that gorgeousness. Hopefully it zoomed in on it. Hopefully it's getting it. I don't know if it is. No, it's not. It's, oh wait. Ah, shit. There we go. There we go. Look at that, it keeps zooming in on the background. But anyways, um, did it come with batteries? <gasps> it came with batteries. Okay, I highly suggest this one if it, if the other one doesn't come with batteries because that is such a plus. It came with rinky dink old headphones, but you know what, if they work, they work. Um, you know, I hate these ones because they hurt my ears, but it's what we're working with. And here is the piece of resistance. Look at that. Hopefully I can, yeah, zoom in for you guys. Has a little handle thing here for you. So that is cool. Okay. I'm really nervous because I really hope this isn't like a cheap, like, because it was not cheap. It was the same price as the other one. I just got this one off Amazon. Um, I hope that it works and everything's fine with it. Oh, so let's pop these babies in. Oh! Popping the batteries in right now is always a fun thing. So basically, I'm just going to turn it on for you guys and myself so that I know that it at least turns on. My fiance is coming over later. Oh, full bars. Okay. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, it hasn't. That's cool. Wow. So you can play it. Um, you can see. You can see the little lights and everything like that. I'll turn it down so it's not that long. But it has an external speaker, which is something cool. So that is neat. Oh, the external speaker is here, not here. I don't know why I was like, ooh, look at the speaker. <laughs> so that is what it looks like. Let's see if I can, there we go. But yeah, okay, okay. Oh, so this is like a backlight slash lamp. So like you can shut it off. Oh, also this is my class ring. I hope that it will zoom in on it. Very pretty class ring. But anyways, that's really cool. And this little thing right here pops up. Do you guys see that? That's nice and adjustable little radio thingy. Okay. FM. Oh, and you can, okay, cool. So you can switch AM and FM and you can also switch Celsius and Fahrenheit. So um, I'm in America, so we use Fahrenheit. I'm not sure about Celsius. Sweep rate. Cool. 
cool. Okay. So I will be right back when I figure out a little bit more information on this thing. Um, my fiance is going to come over later. I'm going to see if he'll be okay with me recording and hopefully us trying it. Um, we do have a cemetery up the road that if he's down for, I'm going to see if I can convince him to go to. Also, I'm going to get him to, <gasps> oh, excuse me. I'm going to get him to bring his ring over. I'm going to go pick him up from his house and, uh, sh oh, excuse me, maybe the hiccups and show you guys the ring but um let's turn that off for now so that is very very cool now that it does not come with a little carrying pouch which i'm kind of sad about because i don't want anything happening to it but um it did look like it said you can there is a carrying pouch you can buy separately which kind of sucks but is understandable so that is pretty cool but basically we'll hopefully be doing a video here shortly and um i will be doing a video um this will be attached to a video of a little investigation for you guys um or i will post another video um shortly very very shortly i promise of us doing an investigation with the spirit box so that you guys have some content to look at um i feel like you guys have been deprived and i feel very very sorry but anyways um it's so basically all i had to share for now um other than that i'm excited to hopefully be back um also during this entire time if i sound crappy i connected it to my professional microphone that i got for like two christmases ago so if i sound crappy i'm sorry i had it on the wrong setting but if i sound amazing yes so without further ado i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you are new to my channel be sure to um if you're watching on a tv go down below with the remote hit the subscribe button super easy to do you can also turn on notifications to be notified when i upload a new video and if you are already subscribed already have notifications on thank you i appreciate you it truly does help i really do want to make something off of youtube i want to give you guys some content um, even if one per person watches, I feel like that's going to be always my motto. If one person watches, that's okay with me, but it's always good to have more people watching. So hope you guys have a good rest of your day and hope you guys have a good holiday. If you celebrate the 4th of July, happy 4th of July. Um, it is July 3rd, so it's tomorrow. Um, be safe, make smart choices, have a good day.